Well, I figured it was about time we did another cocktail, so let's get into a hurricane. Hey guys, welcome back to Cocktail Reviews with the Beer Sarge. Hey, it's summer. I'm, this is a ticky bar. Be stupid not to do some cocktails. So we're going to get into one called The Hurricane. I think you'll like it. It's super fucking easy uh, and it's, it's fucking mint. Um, as you'll see, I've added some tropical notes to the rear of the bar just to give it that flavor. So let's get into it. So the ingredients you'll need for a hurricane is a glass. And I think they call this a hurricane glass, but I'm not sure. A hurricane glass. You will need dark Jamaican rum. I've gone with Karuba because it's the fucking stock standard. You will need passion fruit syrup and you will need a lemon. Right, sounds pretty easy, so let's give it a shot. Right, we need a shaker. We've got one. Right, so we've got our shaker here. Now, to the shaker, we're going to add some crushed ice. Now, it's quite important to use crushed ice. So, I have some that I prepared earlier. So, crushed ice into the shaker. Good thing about this drink is that it's a, uh, you don't have to strain it, so it's, it's you, you shake it in the crushed ice and it just goes straight into the glass. So we start off with, we start off with 120 mils of, you guessed it, the uh, good old Karuba, so 120, so what have we got here? Jiggers are generally in 50s, so we're going for 120, so we need two of these at least, one, Two, and we need to put another what do we need another 20 all right so this is a 25 so we'll use a little bit of this about there all right so there we go that's our 120 mils or what am i saying i think it's yes four ounces of uh, karuba or dark rum now we're going for passion fruit syrup now so passion fruit syrup for this you want uh, 60 you want 60 mils of this so that's one of these at 50 and a little bit more just a tad more to take you to 60 mils of that um, this stuff's quite hard to hard to get eh? this uh, shot passion fruit syrup but um, believe me when you find it it is fucking amazing now thirdly we want uh, this a lemon and I generally I generally don't use um, fresh lemons I generally have a sharp knife too but this is a fuck now I generally have a sharp knife I, and I generally just use fucking lemon juice because yeah and you don't want to squeeze the sticker in there either Whose fucking idea was it to put stickers on bits of fruit? Like, every single piece of fruit has got a fucking sticker on it. I mean, I don't really give a shit that this is a lemon from the United States. Um, I just want a fucking lemon. So, we'll chuck it in this fucking squeezy fucking who's what's it here. Couldn't even cut the lemon fucking straight. Chuck it in the squeezer. Uh, I think you put it in that way. I'm not sure. It's going to make a fucking mess. So... We want 60 mils of this. Jesus, this is going to be a fucking nightmare, I can tell. I think we're going to be lucky to get fucking 60 mils out of this lemon. Give it another fucking crack. Go, you good thing. Alright, that's that one fucked. Get out of there, you piece of shit. And drop the other bugger in there. And see if we can make at least 50. Buy the fucking powers. 
All right, so we didn't quite get fucking 60, but ah, fuck it, whatever. And in that goes fresh squeezed lemon juice. Chuck it into the shaker. Now, you know what they say about shaking? You're supposed to shake a cocktail like from the heart. So, like that. So, we're shaking this up. So it's nice and mixed. Now the secret to these things is to karate chop them. Hey! -ya! And they come apart just like that. And uh, then we pour it un un bloody sieved or strained, or whatever you like to call it, directly into the hurricane glass. And that my my fellow beer drinking aficionados is a fucking hurricane. It looks, it looks fucking really nice and I think I'm gonna really enjoy drinking it. So, uh, let's try it. I, you could put a straw in here and maybe a fucking cherry or a fucking, I don't know, float this lime, lemon juice on the top or, or, or do something, put some garnish on there, a bit of sprig of mint or something, but let's just see what you taste like straight out of the gate. So the rum, like you can taste the rum, which is good because this is what cocktails are all about. It's generally about the alcohol. So you can taste the flavour of the rum. The, the sweetness of the passion fruit, and then you've got the tartness of the, uh, the lemon, which just fucking sort of balances the whole thing out, and it's just a fucking joy to drink. Um, yeah, great. Oh, fucking dribbling it. Shut up! There we go. There's the hurricane. I'll list the ingredients on the side of... Oh, I'll put it here. Right here. I'll list the ingredients. Uh, so you can give this a shot at home. All you need, just go to the warehouse, pick up a fucking real cheap shaker, and mix all this shit at home. It's good. This is another thing that I wouldn't do without, is this uh, ice crusher. It crushes up the ice and makes fucking outstanding drinks. All right, I'm gonna go and murder this dog for making lots of noise, uh, and then I'll catch you again for another beer review or cocktail making lesson. Spot you later. <laughs>